stupid name. Hey, welcome back to um, Punching Insects. On the pedestal is Book of Prophecy, Volume 1. Do you wish to read it? Fuck yeah, I do. Those who walk in the mist, this is the first prophecy. Read it well. Be warned, take heed, the mist is death in disguise. The mist is a cradle of madness. History warns us, the mist stops time. The mist brings chaos. The mist lowers visibility. When the evil mist appears from the west horizon, leave everything and run for your lives. Neat. The god ram awaits you all in the hot depths of the earth. Oh, I hope there's enough room for everybody. Till the heroes of Rosaru defeat the mist. Oh, apparently there was. I thought there was going to be another sentence. Maybe it continues over here. Pedestal of Book of Prophecy, Volume 3. Nope. I'm going to do this shit in order. Put it back. Going over here. I bet you it's over here. See, number two? Book of Prophecy, Volume 2. Do you wish to read it? Yep. I feel like I'm in a library that looks really cool. To those who walk in the mist, this is the second prophecy. Read it well. Everything's on fire! Oh, God. Bob. Bombs blown up. When reality turns into a nightmare and nightmares bring despair, the god Rem is the last hope. Rem leads humans to the depths of the earth and smites them with his bosom. And in his bosom destroys the mist nightmare. Why does he have a bosom? Is Rem like one of those Indian gods that's like both genders or whatever? Is it? Is it Hindu? Is that what I'm thinking of? Ah, anyway. But here this heroes of Rasaru, those who walk through the mist. Thou must show a sign of being the heroes of Rasaru. The path to Rim's bosom is ever steep and hidden in darkness. Unless you buy him a pizza and a movie, and then it's right there in front of you, and he will let you do whatever he wants. Whatever you want, I should say. Gather at the Gate of Shadows. The path to Rim's bosom can be only f uh, the, the, can be found only there. Talking is fun. Dang it. Thanks for breaking the flow of this sweet um, thing where I'm reading about the backstory of Rem and how he... Uh... No, wait, hang on. I want to do... This is best on flying enemies, Pyro Pummel. And there's literally no difference in any of the other moves. Um, let's see. Mirage Lance. And then that one. I'm killing the bee first, by the way. I'm sure you picked up on that by the fact that everybody's beating the crap out of it. Oh! Right in his dick. It's just unfortunate. Uh, I just missed everything. Thanks, lag. Yeah, punched you in the face. Well, that bee's a- ow. Wow, that thing... It's got some echo on it. That's terrifying. More bee. You can kick that thing in the face and then you punch the bee. Okay, there we go. I don't know why I sent Bowser after the bee. He missed every single hit. Yeah. Take that, curry devil. Yes, dead bee. That's, well, I should say. It's more of a wasp or hornet, technically. I don't celebrate dead bees. That's sick. You're sick. Ow. Okay, I need some healage. Um, you can heal Malthorns. You can beat up this thing, but not with that. I want to do a cool move. There we go. And you can heal yourself. There we go. Punch that curry in the face. Well, more gut area, I guess. Nobody really goes for the face or the leg kicks in this game. They just kind of go straight for the cock. Just punching it in the penis until it is dead. Or whatever women have there, I guess. I don't know. I, I'm not very experienced in that area. Whatever it is, I'm sure it's lovely. Troll gnome, I guess. All right, Zubat is here to heal what ails you. I love that his wings are pink. I think that's a really, I think that's a fun, a fun thing. Okay, everybody's healed. Let's beat this thing to death. Just 
intense raw vigor just wail on its face. Or she'll just kill it. That's fine. Speedy Gonzalez over here with her uh, same outfit she's been wearing since I got her, basically. She may need new armor. I'm not entirely sure. I don't remember. Oh yeah, volume three. See, that's the problem with the random encounters in places like this is that uh, I don't remember what I was doing. On the pedestal is Book of Prophecy, volume three. Do you wish to read it? Yes, let's do it. To those who walk in the mist, this is the third prophecy. Read it well. The path to Rim's bosom is at the Gate of Shadows. However, the mouth of the Gate of Shadows is shut. The Gate of Shadows is a stone flower. Only words carved in the four, fa four faces make the flower bloom. Speak to the four faces. Find the words engraved in the faces and engrave them in thine hearts. Or on the notebook you have sitting in your lap. I'm guessing those are the four faces. Anyway, volume four. Prophecy volume four. Do you wish to read it? Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Let's do it. For those who walk in the mist, this is the fourth prophecy. Read it well. I think it'd be really... Couldn't mix it up. Start the book with something else. Like, once upon a time. This was a horrible cliche. The gate of shadows is a stone flower. The words of the four faces will cause a great flower to bloom. However, for the true gate born in the flower, seek out the key. The key is, the key, that key is the star pearl I can't read today. A silent treasure that slumbers deep, deep under the palace of Rel, Rem. The star pearl will open the true gate. Heroes pass. Pass and take the ancient path to Rem's bosom. In the distance, the sound of some machine operating is heard. Oh shit. Oh god. So those aren't the four faces? I'm just supposed to go down there? Flappy bird? Is that what's going on? That's their tongues of stairs! There's stairs there now, wow. Thank, thank you, Captain Deadeye. Who on earth would have could have built such a contraption where if you read four books a pathway will open I'm putting that shit in my fucking mansion that's what i'm doing the star pearl must be at the bottom of the stairs bastard let's go down the stairs the the stairway has teeth ah just let's just go it's fine but it's got teeth on it i don't want to walk into a mouth with teeth are these not these oh hang on let me write this shit down east gate what is that the key is wind this shit down. Key is wind. Alright, that's important. Alright. Weather letters north gate, the key is earth. You guys keep track for me, because I I may forget. Just um whip out a notebook or my favorite my personal favorite is uh the notepad. Ah dang it guessing west and south, but I could be wrong. Ooh, it's an orb again. Okay, you beat the shit out of that orb with extreme prejudice. You also that. Um, yeah, that's fine. And then I need you to wail on the speed, shimmery, shim, dim, damn, mantis man. Mantis man! Ah, uh, the battle cry of the no AP have... I think it's kind of messed up that I need AP to do cool moves, but certain enemies can just... Like that floating shield sword wraith monster can just use all the moves they want without any prep time at all. They don't have to spirit. Why do I? It's, un it's not fair. Um, no, that's 40. I, I will eventually use fire blow, maybe. Alright, there we go. Let's see here. I'm gonna do some bicycle kickies and then that one. Alright. And then you can do that again. Let's. Alright, ready, break. Break an orb in the face. Bam. Absorb. Yeah! Two down. Terra has acquired the power of orb. Oh god. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, oh, you. Oh, it is so on. Or not. This is not Bowser's day. 
Oh yeah, you think you're you think you're hot shit? How huh? block all your moves? Don't even care. Um, no, I need you to heal yourself because you uh, you're sucking it up pretty hard. I need you to do like that. There you go. Um, and then you. That's really not working. Head splitter. There we go. All right. Got this. Bam. God, I wish I could do flips like that. I don't really. That sounds exhausting. Because I'd literally do nothing else but just flip everywhere. Like flip, flip, flip all the way up the stairs, all the way down the stairs. It's kind of like if I had like the Ocarina of Time tumble A to attack roll type deal. I would just do that everywhere. Upstairs, downstairs, interdimensionally, through the air, off of a car, onto a car, into an elevator. <laughs> that one I'd probably actually do though. Just tumble, roll into an elevator. Just crush the dude who's um like right, right next to me, or in the way already. That would be awesome to just injure somebody. With my epicness. Key is fire. Key is fire. I'd look this stuff up, but I'm, I just I don't want to. South gate. Key is water. By your co powers combined, I'm still missing a bunch to be Captain Planet. Key is water. Actually, I wonder. With all these cost these uh, compass things. Uh, in the direction they're in. I wonder if it forms the, uh, wow, the, um, where the symbols are with the, uh, avatar stuff. Oh, God. Whoa. Who the hell is that? Whoa, who is that? Well, well. So you're here to look for treasure, too. Oh, fuck. Who are you? First person I've seen ever. What are you doing here? Ha ha ha! Come to kick my ass. Oh shit, yeah. What am I doing? Some greeting that is. What am I doing? What's the emphasis on that? What am I doing? I should be asking you what you're doing here. It's like Laura Croft meets pixie cut pink haired lady. Asking what you're doing here. Let me introduce myself. I am Kara. K K Kara? Kara. I'm going with Kara because Kara sounds like something out of Undertale. I'm Kara. Kara. Ugh. I'm Kara, a two-bit thief. <laughs> Pronounce her name like for the next five minutes. I like her. I'm Malthor, and this is Bowser and Tongstiff, because we're idiots. Kara, I ask you again. What are you doing here? I'm stealing shit, obviously. Oh you, ma oh, you make me laugh. Doing what you are. Sneak thieving. Sneak thieving. That's, um, I'm gonna start using that. Sneak thieving. What are you doing in this store? What? Sneak thieving, bitch. Something bad. It's stealing from people. Is that what sneak thieving? Is sneak thieving a thing? It sounds like a tongue twister. Line. Hop, hop. No, we have nothing. That's wrong. Sneak thieving is wrong. I hate bad people. The moral compass of Captain Freaking America. Ha, give me a break. Stop talking like a goody two shoes. I'll pimp slap the shit at you. You mean you're going home empty handed even though everyone ran away and the town is deserted? What did you just say? Everyone ran away. Uh, wow, how'd they do that walk in this low poly? That's impressive. Oh boy, you guys are really clueless. That's right, everyone's gone. They knew the mist was coming and they took the elevator to an underground shelter to hide. Why does everybody have an underground bunker? Why did I start in a town that just had really big walls? Underground shelter? So he's a, he's still alive. Hari's still alive. Let's take the elevator and go find him. I'm going to make that joke until it's not funny, which... It, three times ago. Sorry, kid, but the elevator won't work. It's locked, probably as a safety precaution. 
But yeah, we're gonna literally open it up, fill it full of mist, and then come down, and then our Saru are gonna go ape shit and kill everyone. Wow, she's very emotional today. Oh, boo hoo! Boo hoo! Oh, brother. Uh, Say if it's valuables are after, there are none here. I took them all. Townspeople must have taken everything with them when they went underground. Those two bit bastards. That backflip was cool, but unnecessary. Just fucking twist her ankle. Ah! The only thing I found was some measly jewel card, the Star Pearl or something. Wait a minute. Kara. The Star Pearl, where is it? I'm gonna. I don't. I hope I don't run into her too much. I can't do that name. You want that piece of junk? Ha ha ha! Well, then I'll tell you where it is. I palmed the Star Pearl off to a jeweler in Jeremy. I think his name was Salon or something. Oh, well, that's easy. I don't have to fight you and probably lose. Kara, wait, we still have much to ask you. You're so hot. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, I don't have anything to say to you. See you later, Marshmallow Man. I like her. She's very animated. Also super hot. Oh, that short hair really does it for me. I don't get it. How can she travel through the mist at will without a Rosaru? She clearly has a Rosaru. She's my fourth party member and way better than you. The Star Pearl. Bowser, Zalon, and Zalon and Jeremy has the Star Pearl. Zalon in Jeremy has the Star Pearl. I just... Can I open this? If it won't open, the power must be turned off. I'll be back later to free you from your very wise and happy prison. Walk up the stairs. Trigger another battle or 5,000. Da, 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 da. There it is. Let's fight on the stairs. That won't cause problems. It's gonna cause problems. Last orb. All right. Everybody else is gonna wail on this bee while he sadly tries to get his hands on this orb. Oh fuck! Not that. I need this one. There we go. Um. Yeah. Just punch in the face. Okay. Ready? Break my spine. <laughs> I just noticed the battlefield is on the stair thingies, but the stairs are whoa. Please please do that more. That was legit terrifying. Yeah. Enjoy all of your getting beat on. Yeah, punch the bee in the face. Okay, um you just do that. She's gonna kill the bee, I'm sure. You spirit. Alright, there we go. Ow, ow. Beat him up. Beat, beat him up. <laughs> Dead bee. It's called a killer bee. I don't think it's. It's like a wasp. I already said that. I feel uncomfortable celebrating a dead bee. It's not cool. They're almost extinct, yo. Bad game, making me feel guilty. No, not you. Just um. Do a hurricane. That'll. That'll teach it a lesson. There we go. I probably should have healed, but whatever. I don't know. I haven't really been paying attention to that so far. Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Don't do that much. Don't be that much. I, I have no idea how much it healed for. Yeah, hurricane's where it's at. All right, every, everybody's going to spear it until he kills it. He's the last one. Who doesn't have one and that's not gonna do a move but who cares all right let's do this everybody gets a nice AP replenishment action oh no oh no it beat on my face a little bit kill it absorb damn it no oh Bowser oh Bowser you have failed me for the first time this episode probably not well that was fun I didn't have to fight that Kara person she looked pretty tough okay um, actually let me do a little healage because he doesn't have it yet like a butt there we go that is so handy oh my god it makes me so happy I have a new healage. Alright, there was that. 
So I guess I just gotta get the fuck out of here. This way, I guess. Really nothing else in this town that's very interesting. A killer bee and a mad mantis. Okay, um, not that. Um, this one. There you go. Yep, that'll work. And then you just do that same thing. Alright, everybody break. This thing's spine. Except it's a bug because it doesn't, doesn't have a spine. Yeah. Still alive. Enemies are really freaking hardy right now. I'm just saying. When am I gonna get new equipment that's really good? Like, an ultimate weapon would be nice of some sort. The ultimate final sword of Bowser's ability or whatever. There we go. There, everybody just do the same shit as before and this thing will die. I just noticed that I'm I'm taking less damage, sort of, and they're just they take a lot more punishment before they go down. That's pretty much it. Just let me leave. As in, throw your life away so I can absorb your essence and drink you like soup. All right. Yay, that was fun. I beat up a bunch of helpless. Well, not really helpless, but I beat up some things. Can I leave now? Is this uh, is this out? Am I am I gone? Oh my god, I made it! Uh, I have to walk all the way back to Jeremy. Boo! Might as well go get the star pearly flower thing and just go from there. All right, last battle of the episode. Hey, it's oak slime. That's isn't that just sap? Or is it literally the slime of Professor Oak? And then you can do, um, crap. You can do crap. There we go. Take that. Yeah. Beat you up. Oh, no. Death of Kiss. Duh. This kiss is why the band broke up. Oh, she's paralyzed. Well, that's awkward. Yeah, beat him up. Ah, more punchies. Back punch. All right. Oh no, he's coming. Oh, ow. Oh, that hurt slightly. Ow. Aha, uh -huh, blocked you. Take that. And then do stuff to it. Um have any there we go uh sure ah oh, he woke her from her slumber but she has no kung fu yeah dead take that you kid he melted I think it'll eventually just escalate because the first one was L Lipian, which I think is a play on Lilliputian. And then this one, they're Lip, Lip Kids, so you think it'll go all the way to, um. Fucking. Lil. Lip. Lippy Old Man. And it's just. It, but it has like a fucking cane. It's just like. A kiss of death, you. Mwah. And you just gives you a new status effect called like grossed out or something. <laughs> All right. Anyway, next time on B Punch, um, I'm gonna we're gonna head to the place and do the thing. <laughs>